Hello, everybody. Welcome to MyAmericanFarm.org, the new show from MinMax. MinMax is a place about games, friends, and getting better. Welcome. My name is Ben Hansen. I'm joined by Sarah Podzorski, the farm girl herself. Yeah, absolute farm and agricultural uh, expert. Definitely not only when it comes to farming sims. Dude, I just saw you You tweeted that you went out and picked up a flower or something because the frost was coming to Minnesota. You're a farmer because you did that. I'm, I'm a, I'm, I got one flower. Call me big agriculture. <laughs> Monsanto's going to be knocking on my door. Mm, uh, this show, of course, new show plus. Each and every week, if you're at the $10 tier on Patreon, you can vote to choose which new show we create or continue. And this is, you can't come up with a better reason for why I love the MinMax community, because we gave them a bunch of great shows. And then just a cryptic, blurry photo from a history museum I was at in southwest Minnesota over the weekend, because there was just a big banner there. And it said, hey, please visit myamericanfarm.org, where you can do edutainment games and hot uh, hot uh, activities online talking about the farming experience that was all we needed to put in there and then it won by a landslide um yeah it i never ceased to be amazed by the min max are community. you chewing out a piece of spaghetti no 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 this is hayseed sorry if you oh, were... i thought that was is that uncooked no pasta in no your mouth? <laughs> absolutely not this is hayseed, <laughs> Sarah. no doubt about it now we're gonna check out this site I incorrectly listed it as myamericanfarm.com for the mm. poll. Maybe that's why people voted for it, because they wanted that sweet commerce, capitalism, am I right, everybody? Mm-hmm. Uh, it's actually my, myamericanfarm.org, which makes it uh, more sophisticated and intelligent and uh, respectable, I think, right? I don't know. Part of me thinks, part of me hopes that I come out learning fun facts about agriculture. Yeah. And part of me thinks that this might be big agriculture propaganda. Mmm. So it's all going to be like, give your money to Monsanto. That's the activity. Yeah, it's all going to be like big egg <laughs> it's coming be in. The pipe mini game, but you're just running all your cash through a pipe going to Monsanto. Yeah. Um, now, I do have a couple things, Sarah. I ain't, I ain't no farmer. I did grow up, I guess, picking <laughs> asparagus. I thought that you were an job. asparagus farmer. <laughs> Literally. That's what I have right here is a bunch oh of my God. spicy pickled asparagus from... Uh, from back home, which is super spicy, and I'll get to it in a bit. Um, but uh, in the cities here in Minneapolis, where we live, I don't have much going on in the backyard. But somehow, I don't know if the landlords did it. Somebody planted a little cherry tomato plant. So I've been watching that, and literally in your backyard. Yeah. Oh. And you don't know how it got there. I don't know how it got there. You live an amazing life. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Sarah. I really took that to heart. So uh, one was just ready as the frost is coming in Minneapolis. So here we go. So we're all a little bit farmers today. Mmm. Mmm. You know what makes a cherry tomato better? What? Hard pasta. Hard pasta. (laughs) Okay. Here we go. Now, are you ready to go to this site, Sarah? Yes. Okay. MyAmericanFarm.org. Now, do you have any predictions for what this site's going to be? I imagine it'll look like the average, like, child's education site, where, Mm -hmm. like, it kind of looks like a blog of, like, all the the stuff that you don't want to read. You know know the sites that you get a worksheet for? Yeah. Your teacher gives you a worksheet, and they're like, go to this site. Yeah. And you can play the games, or you can, like, hunt. I think that's what it's going to look like. Mm -hmm. Here's hoping. Ooh. This ooh. looks better than I expected. Ooh, also, gamers rejoice. We got a pixelated chicken here. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, hang on. Did, okay. <laughs> 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. My god. Look, Sarah, they horses. They have apps. <laughs> this is unbelievable. We get to choose sound effects for this. We get to choose how advanced we want the knowledge to be. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, the oh apps. My God. Maybe that's like for next week or something. Um, let's let's Stop. just start exploring and see what we got. From seed to shirt. Oh, this is math pass pass. Well, we're go- Sarah. This is a hundred percent run for my American farm. Funded by Nichino America. Can somebody Google that? Um, let's see. We can also do a hundred percent run on their site. Where's the money coming from? Our products provide crop-specific solutions and fit with today's agricultural practices. I mean, seven positive Google reviews. Wow. They are customer-focused. Those are some good good reviews. Although, I'm suspicious. Somebody just left a review that just says, good company, which... 
Good company. No one's ever left that review for Min Max. Uh, I'd like to see it. Okay. Good company. <laughs> oh my god. All right. All right. We get it. We get it. So that seems pretty good. Ooh, this one seems sweet. We get to build our own tractor? Golf course management? That's a tag? Whoa. Nothing says that farms not like golf course. That one's not sponsored. These aren't sponsored. Only this one's sponsored. Interesting. So we can find the propaganda for Nichino America yeah. in there. Wild Water Adventures. Oh, that's going to be the fun one. I love irrigation. Oh, where in the world? Where in... The what is this? Someone stole facts from the My American Farm Library. Oh my god. Thrive. Am I right, everybody? Okay, take a journey into the earth. That sounds pretty good. Sarah? The stakes are high! Funded by beef! <laughs> These cows are outraged. They look a little mad. <laughs> Wouldn't you be? If you were born as a cow, your first words would be, God damn it. This one won an award. Look, look, look. Well, Sarah also has control of the mouse, by the way. So if people are confused, what what award is this? Horizon Zero Dawn? Interactive Award Let's gold see. winner. Horizon Interactive Award. Oh, my God. Can we look at... Can we win this with Trivia Tower? Can we enter a MinHax game into it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> These are beautiful. I, it doesn't clear. seem like it's hard to win. Yeah, we could do this. So, so past winners, okay, features. I like the best of show. Okay. Yeah, this this seems completely beatable. I mean, they have Samuel L. Jackson, but who doesn't? Master of class, we can beat them. Easy. Okay, the great. There's so many. Search. This is absurd. International trade. Weird for a tag. That that's life. Let's grow. <laughs> okay, this one seems fun. Action packed. Nothing about watching a wheel spin feels action packed to me, mm -hmm. but I don't know. Power up. Egg sighting. There's poultry. so many. Oh my gosh. This is. Hang on. Sarah, Wait, that one's sponsored by Peanuts. This is. Okay, there's a. My a little, little egg, me. <laughs> All right, obviously we're starting with my little egg me. Let's make something tasty. We I don't even know where to start. We committed like, to 100% run of this. But I am overwhelmed. Harvest this. Grocery grab. Another Horizon winner. Finders keepers. There's no way these are actual games. They're all. They all have to be. Ooh, that one's gonna be hard. Load the lunchbox. Factor <laughs> fairy tale. In my barn. Okay. So they also said Wait. there were oh, like. Oh, these are the apps. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Interesting. All about beef. All about that beef. This is really impressive. So they said there were, on the billboard thing, they said there were e-comics. Um, uh -huh. Let's see. So newsletter about... We might have to contact them to thank them. Now, will this filter? Okay, so these are the ages here. I see. So it filters if yeah. you select. This is a hell of a site. Way yeah. to go, whoever built this. Uh, what... <laughs> There we go. Let's do it. Uh, I hope that they're like, that's too old. <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> okay. And I'm always truthful with these because you never know when it'll come back to bite you. I, don't I was to... surprised they don't boot you. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I want to get on that necessarily for the mailing list. So they they lied about the e-comics by the looks <laughs> of it. Okay. All right. Lisa, I mean, maybe, they're, they're, maybe they're in the game. Maybe they're in the game. That's like the victory screen? No, no, the, the e-comics. Yeah. Okay. Corteva? That just sounds evil. Cor I don't know. I feel like all agricultural companies sound evil. There's no way they're good. Corteva Agri-Science. How do you find out? Okay. I don't on. know where you would find their Google reviews for a... Uh... Is Cortego Agri-Science evil? I think it said evil. Ooh. Oh, no! Corteva is the new Monsanto. It's a question mark on Reddit, Sarah. We can't take this for okay, gospel. Okay, it has no upvotes. Hmm. It's positive spin commercials for Corteva. This company was testing fungicides on beagles. <laughs> what? The, the beagle of the dogs? Like yes. Um. Let's see. Uh, every company advertises. You can't be mad at them. Okay. 
Well, look, they're running pesticides on beagles, but we don't know for sure if they're an evil well, company. We have no con. We saw it on a post on Reddit. We have no confirmation that that's actually true. You can't hold us to it. Ooh. What about Indeed? That's if we're working there. Yeah. There are great coworkers there. I don't want to do this at all. Fine. All right, on with the show. This is it. Here we go. So, okay. Oh, Should the, we just start from the top and roll down? Well, let's start with the one, my little egg me. My little egg me. Let's okay. really kick the is door there, down. Yeah, I wish there was like, a, is there like a starting point? Like, mm. no, probably. Start, like we could. Kinder, kindergartner. That's and, the like, question. Up? That's an interesting idea. Let's just go down the list. Like, we keep it. Uh, Variety okay. is a spice of life here. By the way, thanks everybody for throwing subs our way. When we hit that goal, we'll be uh, rejecting, rejecting, reviving a rejected. Uh, new show plus show as a as a bonus stream for new show overflow. So thanks everybody for following us on Twitch. Um, okay, I'm gonna. Do you want to take the reins for my little egg me? To hit play game. I think so. Okay, let's see. Are you ready to jump into a career in agriculture? Step into the world. You're zooming it in. Step into the world of agriculture careers as you try on the clothes, pick up the tools, and yeah. visit the places where men and women of America agriculture work. Okay, I'm so excited for That's this. That's perfect. Oh, you didn't even want to learn Let's how see. to play. Why? Why would I? I'm a professional gamer. Okay. How many different career focus areas are in agriculture? Everyone knows Obviously. There's... Sarah, 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 whoa, whoa. Sarah, don't click zero. There were what? Four kiddos in the image? On the. But we don't have a four. We have. There's got to be at least three, right? I'm going five. You know what? You want five? Would our dear friends at, what was the name of the evil corporation? Consanto? Corteva? Corteva. Would they want us to think, they want us to think there's a lot of opportunities in farming, so it has to be nine, right? At least nine. Okay. Way to go. Way to go, we did it. Play on, player. Okay, Ooh. who do we want to be? Oh, hang on, hang on, Sarah. I like oh, hang on, let me take control. I think we got... Yeah, this is the music for My Little Egg Me, so we need to stop the other music. Get the ukulele out. Perfect. Kids love ukuleles. Okay. Okay. I'm going to be her. Oh, ooh, my God. Ooh, I don't ooh. consider florist a career in agriculture. I actually. don't consider it a career at all. Um, ooh, we could be a little egg journalist, and then we'd get the kicked out the <laughs> window before Corteva journalist. comes at us. Quit Googling our corporations. Irrigation specialist? Teacher, diesel mechanic, fisheries biologist, produce buyer, plant scientist, or farmer. Sarah, I don't mean to make it as simple as this, but what do you think is like the cutest outfit? Hmm. That's a tough one, actually. Yeah. No, it's not. I know exactly what. Oh. Hang on. I know what you're going to do. What are you, what okay. are you doing? I, I, I will point at the one that I think you're going to do. <laughs> and then you choose yours, and I'll tell you if it lines up. Okay. Okay. Hang on, hang on, Are hang you on. pointing? No, hang on. That's a terrible way to do it. I have to write it down in my phone. <laughs> okay. This doesn't make any sense. Okay. Can I just pick? Yep, choose. Uh, to be honest, I haven't even decided yet, so you're ahead of me. Um, let's see. <laughs> People are saying Honestly, AG just... journalist is a games journalist. That's a right. A games journalist? <laughs> <laughs> let's see. I really like the farmer one for the bandana. And you're choosing that. Which one did you pick? Yeah, which one did you pick? I thought you were going large animal vet. That feels like a Sarah outfit. I thought large animal vet was cute, but I didn't like the boots. Oh, uh, the boots. Those are the boots off. for stepping in the shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not interested. But I think I'd rather learn about irrigation specialists. Mm. If I had to pick. Freaking nerd. All right, do it. Oh wow. Where does the water go? In what type of workplace would you find this person? A race track, field? Race track, a race testing track. lab. Race track. Race track. Race track. Oh man. Corteva, disappointed. Do you think this is like a recruitment tool for Corteva? Yes, I do. At the end, they'll just like be like, connect with us on LinkedIn. <laughs> Children. <laughs> uh, Let's see, what tools will this person need to do their job well? Probes to test the soil, irrigation system, or a grain feeder? Uh, Would the irrigation specialist even need irrigation systems if they're the specialist? They're not a, they're not a sprinkler. Are irrigation systems just a crutch for people who don't have irrigation specialists? I feel like this is a test. We should, it should be all three. What is the irrigation specialist need a grain feeder for? So they can lure the animals away from where they want to irrigate. 
Nice, nice. So you're telling me they- I don't know about that one. Yeah, they, they definitely need to test that soil too. Yeah. What challenges will this person need to solve in their job? Shrinking. Finding people that break wildlife laws. Shrinking number of fish in ponds or not enough water in the West. I like this guy that's just ready to crack skulls. He's gonna put It literally there. looks like he's about to take someone down. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna go with the water one, sir. Okay. Nice. Good job. God damn. We're learning so much. What do you think a person in this job might be interested in? What are their hobbies? Don't don't you think they love conserving water? Yeah, yeah. The irrigation specialists love to not use water. Yeah, they're out of a they job. They hate starting a greenhouse because a greenhouse uses water. It does, it does. Hmm. Yeah, they don't want to deal with the kids. That's a no-go. No. You can't wrangle no. students with a... All kids do hand. is waste water. They're like enemy number one. Yeah, they drink it. Oh, sh should 70. we see this career in action? Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. My name is Monty Bottens, and I am a water and crop management specialist. Monty I love him. We work directly I fucking with love growers him. to help them produce <laughs> crops in the most cost efficient manner possible by looking at the inputs that they're using in regards to fertility inputs, water management and equipment inputs to make sure that everything is working in a synergistic fashion to get the most yield. Well, there's several things that we can do Again, with the soil. Again, a lot better produced than I water. thought it would be. One I'm really we can impressed. reduce tillage. We're reducing the you amount that we evaporate. You might be surprised that agriculture Two actually is, has is a lot of Two is if we leave a residue right? on the surface, we re reduce the amount of evaporation. But three is, is if we can grow a bigger crop with the same amount of water, we may not have saved water. Because you can see him having fun with like that little pose that he had to do. I, most people, it would be it's agony. Science, yeah, he's leaning in there. He knows what to do. Uh, we know the science. What the hell's going on? But farmers oh. are artists, too, in making, applying the science. Well, one of the things that farmers I'm are artists mind too. Is go, money, what go. What we can do there to increase efficiency Don't fall moving in. away from You're gravitational irrigation to drip systems and overhead sprinklers. Next thing we can look at is what's actually going on. Do you want in the a soil, spicy asparagus, sir? Chemical balance within yeah. the soil. Okay, you just want to drive over then real quick. After that, we look at growing Can't a plant over. that has okay. a more efficient root system and a larger root mass to get the water into the plant. And then from there, making sure that we're feeding that plant How right through this? the rest of the season, Not long keeping enough. it healthy so it continues to grow new roots to improve water use. Not weird to ask, is this a secret dock lightning submission? Here, That's exactly and right. even groundwater continues to, to drop. Whew. And we have to conserve and make the best of what we can for today so that there's more for future generations. Money. Well Money. said, Monty. Well said. God dang. I wouldn't mind meeting him when I grow up. All right, cool. I'm going to take control. Assuming control. Let's, uh... I hope the points carry over to everything here. I... <laughs> I think it was out of a hundred because we didn't get some right. Really? No. Well, maybe it's not the career for you. Oh, whoops. Okay, go back <laughs> to this. Okay. Well. You fucking broke it. I I shouldn't have pushed it to its limits. Now there's one. Should we play the sponsored ones? Like, should we play it from seed to shirt? Yeah. Should we just go down the list? Yeah. Okay. To turn fiber into fashion is amazing amusement. Harvest a bumper crop of fun. Oh, I wish these games had ratings so I could like. Find like the top rated game on this site and mm, play it. Sort by yeah user reviews. Yeah, some of these sort are, by user reviews. Some of them are getting review bombed by people. <laughs> All these games they're too woke. They're going broke. You get the idea. Let's go. Oh. I need new clothes for the first day of school. Come to my family farm to learn how cotton is grown. No, you don't understand, Mulva. I need shirts. I don't. Need <laughs> I don't to need learn. cotton. I need a shirt. <laughs> Herb is going to visit Mulva's family farm to see how cotton is grown and to learn how clothes are made. You can help Herb win some new clothes. Can you just give this man a shirt, please? No, he has to earn it. Let's let's go to the farm. By that, no, you mean the store? That's the store. Uh -uh, uh -uh. Go to Mulva. Go to Mulva. <laughs> I like the song looping every time you click. Choose the cedar okay, spreader the and dragon the... spreader. I, I will judge you if you pick the wrong vehicle. Yeah. And you, you're confident you know what it is? Yeah. Yeah, that is correct. Thank you. <gasps> Look at it go! No, it's going off the cliff! Planters can ah! plant up to 24 rows or more at the time. The planter opens a small trench or furrow. All right. Cool technology like this can help the farmer know where they are planting. 
It's right. so cool. I haven't seen many corporate logos in here yet. Okay, drag the different pieces of your irrigation system into the field. Yeah, I'm confused about how this is math. <laughs> I mean, but it I'm not upset about it. Yeah, it's taxing my brain as if it was math. Oh. You did it. <laughs> I didn't put it in that right spot at all. Your center pivot irrigation system complete. Press the start button to turn on the... All right. You ready to see some serious stuff, everybody? Yeah. Here we go. Irrigate it. Whoa! <laughs> Look, animating that Wild card. crops. Meanwhile, Herb is out here with a cold wind blowing by his bare chest, just trying to get a freaking yeah. shirt. <laughs> he still doesn't have a shirt on. Okay, tractor with a sprayer. <coughs> All right, it's gotta be this one. Wow. Farmers use only what they need to keep the soil in good shape. I don't know if I believe that. No, that feels like propaganda. You think? Do you like farmers, sir? I mean, yes and no. What don't you like about farmers? I don't like big egg. Yeah, but that's not farmers. I mean, you could technically call them farmers. Someone still has to work those fields. I guess. I, um, <laughs> when I'm driving out to my parents' place, which we do a lot over the summer, um, we always we go by just, you know, it's two hours of cornfields and stuff, you know? But there's this one farm that just has this awesome, it's not, it's beyond a silo. It's just like a weird metal construction, which is like this tower in the middle of a ton of cornfields and there's a ladder on it. And my dream is at some point, I just want to pull over and just ask him, can I just climb that ladder? I just want to see from the top of this. And it's right there. We could probably do it in the middle of the night. They'd have no idea. Mm -hmm. Okay, weeds are pop. <laughs> Thank you, Sarah. That was the correct response. Weeds are popping up that will make it harder for you to for your cotton to grow. Protect your crop by dragging the right item. Okay, we need branded herbicide. No, do the milk. Do the milk. All right. Milk, milk, milk. <clears throat> Please use herbicide. This is this is a pro herbicide yeah. propaganda. Pour the herbicide on this beagle to continue. When weeds are left to grow, they use the water and nutrients that the cotton plants need. Farmers might also spray insects that are protect against harmful bugs. Yeah, I got it. Farmers only use as much as they need, yeah, children. Remember right. this. The first true leaf changes the plant's focus from coming out of the soil to growing more leaves. Do you think you could be a farmer, Sarah? No, I don't like getting up early. Uh, or manual labor. Yeah. Other than that, like if you inherited a big farm, you'd be like countdown to selling it. There's not a party that's like, maybe I could just go out there and live a good country life. If there's, if it's a big enough farm that there's already people to do the work for me, yeah, I will live there and watch them. But other than that, I can only really handle a hobby farm. Okay, but then you would be big egg. You realize you'd be technically no, I wouldn't. If it's a hobby farm. Oh, hobby farm. Okay, but I'm talking about if you had a bunch of employees underneath you. That's there's no difference. Only if it was a family them. farm and we didn't like ladder up to. Right. Big corporation. But they're always trying to buy your land. You're like, it's not yeah. for sale. They knock on my door and they're like, you have to sell eventually. And then, and then the film starts. Yeah. Uh, nodes are points where leaves and branches form. Internodes are the spaces between nodes. Click a node or internode. Well, don't mind if I do click a little internode. The pinhead square is the first sign of the cotton forming on the stem. Click it. Help Herb, please. Buds. He's like still like standing there without his shirt on, watching the cotton grow. Bulls are the round, fluffy clumps. Oh, like a bull weevil. I've heard of them. Fluffy clumps in which cotton grows. Click one to advance. All right. Shadowy figure. I love that like the proper thing is always like very clearly labeled and looks like the friendliest. You mean a drippy paint bucket isn't the way to go? Yeah, it's not giving what it needs to give. Defoliate. It's important to do every morning once you get out of the shower, everybody. The plants are nearly ready to harvest, but first we need to remove the leaves. Choose the defoliant from below. All right, well. Give it coffee, give it coffee. Oh, crap. No! Sorry, my bad. I have to plants to remove the leaves. This makes harvesting the cotton easier and more efficient. There's also the bowl, also a bowl opener to open unopened bowls. All right, well, time for a little harvester. Is it this bad boy? Yeah. Zoom, zoom. What is this pizza wheel on the back? I think it like rolls it up. Into a shirt? Yeah. And that's how shirts are made. 
Once the cotton is harvested, it must be removed from the harvester and stored. Cotton is stored in huge modules, shaped like a gigantic loaf of bread. Okay, yeah, put this on your back, Herb. Time to load up the cotton. Okay, this is pretty don't, good. Don't grab the cat. That's not cotton. Oh, oh. Oh, no, I can't even drag no. and drop it. That's Too not full. it. 24,000. Didn't it say 25,000 before? I wasn't paying that close attention. You want to be a farmer? Grab or the not, cat. Sir? Grab the cat. Grab the cat. Yeah. Boing, not cotton. Is that just a rock? Whoa. From seed to shirt. Storage. I like how they're like, and they like, they made us like painstakingly watch the cotton growing process. Yeah. And they're like, and then um, like all this stuff happens. Then a bunch of people work a lot, yeah. Uh, Sarah, pop quiz. Who invented the cotton gin? Like the, do you know? Yeah, I have a name in my head. I don't know why. I don't know why oh, this was drilled uh, into our skulls. I have no clue. Who invented e it? Eli Whitney, our main man. Um, oh, this is, you can't. How do you know that? I don't know. I feel like everyone learns that. I don't know. Yeah. Um, but here's the thing. Look, this is obviously worthy of a Horizon Award. This one didn't. Did this? This one didn't win. It did, but it should have. But at the same time, you can't put the next thing on the left on side the of left. the screen. It doesn't work. Oh my god. Wait. So at the end of the day, we could just go and get a shirt. Like, why did we have to go to the farm? Ooh, get a lot of this, Sarah. Did you know that. U.S. dollar bills contain 75% cotton? If one bale of cotton can make 313,000... Oh, this is I'm not doing. I'm not doing this math. Hell Sarah, no. I'm not doing this freaking math. <laughs> I'm not doing this math. I am terrible at math. Okay, let's really try and do it. Okay. I went to a liberal arts school. Uh, I took logic as my math requirement in college. Oh my god. I dodged it completely. If one bale of cotton can make... 313,000. Uh. <laughs> what? What? Okay, that one. I knew it wasn't that one. Okay, Sarah Sarah <laughs> took command. All right, great job. I just you can't believe you took logic. I'm never going to forget that. Uh, okay, you earned a shirt. Drag one onto little Give him Herbie. the purple one. Give him the purple one. Yeah, gender norms yeah. out the window. Oh, God. What have you done to me, Herb? It's for cattle feed. What? Oh, this is where the math is. All right. Every year, about 6.5 billion tons of cotton seed are produced, and about two-thirds of that is fed to cattle. How much is that? I mean, I guess that's probably 4 billion tons, right? I have no right? clue. I mean, this one's easier than the last yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. It's got to be less, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're on top of it. There's the logic kicking in. Yeah, come on, Twitch. You're saying we don't know math? Come on. All right. <laughs> uh, what looks great? Uh, give him the blue. That's I want him to lick him. Put the hot pants on him. It's really boring. No, it's not. With the purple? All right. Oh my god. Fun quiz? I'm sorry. What is our definition of fun if this is the fun quiz? Every time you get a question wrong, they should just raise the volume on this three second loop. <laughs> if cotton is being sold at 69 cents a pound and a farmer can grow 900 pounds on an acre, how much money can the farmer make on an acre? Okay, so 69 times 900. 900. Otherwise known as Jeff Holmes' college experience. <laughs> That's not a joke. Um, so it would have to be this. God damn it. It'd have to be this. Did it. Did it. Great job. You earned a sock. Drag one onto Herb. Oh, come on, Sarah. Don't blow it. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Oh, Wait, just... why did you only get one sock? <laughs> so that we can do <laughs> more math. What the hell is this? This is like a nightmare. Okay, one bale of cotton weighs <laughs> 480 pounds. It can make 215. Can we try and find an action-packed <laughs> game after this? <laughs> All right. Okay, one bale of cotton weighs 480 pounds. It can make 215 pairs of jeans. About how many pounds of cotton does it take to make 10 pairs of jeans? There's truly no universe where I could answer this. Like, we know it's not one, obviously. We could just eliminate that to begin that's with. That's out. So, okay, we got... I swear to God, sir, I'm not exaggerating my stupidity. If I were to sit here for the next three hours, I would not be able to figure this out. 
I think if I had a calculator, I could do it. Well, yeah, yeah. Look, you think farmers out on the hardworking farm have got calculators? Obviously, they have no technology. Did yeah. you pick one? I told you it wasn't one. I told you it wasn't one. I think one. it's 22. Sarah! Oh my god, he gets another sock? Lucky boy. And it's gonna be... Where are you going? Uh, give him the weird red ringworm ones. <laughs> Looks like the, his foot the, has a disease. Yeah. Cotton feels great. Looks great, too. Uh, I don't know about that one. <laughs> Look, you can see his socks. That's cute. Why is he so much taller? Why is his foot busting free of his shoe <laughs> down here? You answered all the questions correctly and earned a full outfit for Herb's first day of school. Do you I like how he had to earn his outfit. Right. We all should earn outfits. Yeah. Um, Sarah, if you could snap your fingers and make it so that no clothes on Earth were ever made again, would you do it? So it's like, I don't know, like the idea of like, we have enough clothes on Earth now for everybody, we, need, we can stop. No, it's probably a bad idea. It'd probably help the environment or something. Well, no, because like, oh. eventually we would run out of clothes. I don't think we would. And I don't think everyone has enough clothes. Yeah, but if you so even if it just, out. just, like, got rid of all the clothes. Look. I, and so nobody can make new clothes. I could I could just wear, like, three shirts the rest of my life, and I'd be fine. I'd be You'd happy. have to assume that, like, the world would have to end within a certain amount of time. Yeah, okay. Or else the clothes would naturally degrade. Yeah, but it'd be like the Matrix. Like, even if they're degrading, they look kind of cool. A lot of things are like the Matrix. Hey, look at this. Cotton is the most widely used textile fiber in the world. Making a... With your new cotton knowledge, you've earned a passport stamp. Cut it out and attach it to your passport to sustainability. Is this, do we need to like print the screen? To yeah, do wait, this? how do we cut it out? I don't know. Um, okay, I guess, I guess we can do it. Take a look around and count how many items you use in your home and wear in your body. I really had no idea that dollar bills had so much cotton in them. Oh, people are saying we should, this should be an extra life option pretty smart okay so we're gonna have that forever uh and now I love the way it's just flashing yeah it's aggressive let's go find one of the games that won an award yeah okay download the kiosk oh look at this oh they want our feedback there are user reviews i'm a gamer yeah they should have uh, hired a consultant for these thank you john scovic for the big sub okay Back to the top, Sarah. I'll let you steer. Okay, where's the ones that got an award? This one. The stakes are high. Yep. That looks also really good. funded by Big Beef. Hang on. Okay. Wait, wait, and wait. it also unfortunately has math in it. Yeah, we don't. Do we need that? What about that action packed one? Are we. Okay, you're using the word action packed. Well, they did. Okay, go A little up. loosely. It, it was here. up here. It was up. Oh, was it? Don't play my little AG me again. Up, 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 up. It was the wheel. It was the wheel. The wheel that didn't look action packed. The wheel is down. No, it wasn't, Sarah. Sarah. Yes, it is. Farm right. No, 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 it's not. You you went right by it. Hand to God. You no up. Is up. it up? Uh, <laughs> it is. You also have the mouse. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm assuming control. <laughs> right there. That one didn't win an award. Yeah, but it's action packed. All right. But we can. Okay, fine. We can play it. Nope. You're choosing. You're choosing. No, 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 no. We're playing it. Look okay. at it. it. Looks action packed. If it sucks, and I'm it's not, not on the me. Directions. Okay. Solve the puzzles to learn more about just how much science and technology goes into today's agriculture. Okay. Pick a category. Tool, science, Ooh. new discoveries, or careers. New discoveries sounds exciting. <gasps> we gotta be Ben! We gotta be Ben. Hi, I'm Ben. I use technology in my job as a corn farmer to keep track of what I plant and when I plant it. Hmm. Like, just a note app on your phone, you think? I don't know, but Ashley's a horse therapist. Which honestly sounds way more interesting than corn farmer. Horse therapist? Is that genuinely yeah. to, like, soothe horses' hearts? <laughs> no. They're horses, I think. Physically? That's... I thought that, like, you people interacted with horses and it was their therapy do the horses need therapy let's check oh what about what if we beat it maybe it'll tell us have a little video what is this okay this looks horrible no this looks possible this tool helps farmers and ranchers identify precise locations using satellite technology jesus christ 
a GPS? Like here we go. Spin it. We've played this on Neutral Plus before. Oh, good spin, Sarah. Great action. <laughs> okay, what letter do we want? Uh, I'm gonna go with E, Sarah. Okay, there's one E. Do we have to spin Can, again? Are you ready to solve it? <laughs> what is the the Wheel of Fortune thing at the end for the most common letters? It's like R.L. Stein or something. Um, lose <laughs> all. Lose all hope. Um, take it away, Sarah. Isn't this for children? No. Yeah, eventually they'll figure it out. Banana. Uh, this is, um, my parents just dropped it what off. What does this have to do with horse therapy? We'll get to it. But, uh, my parents just dropped it off. This is, uh, apple and grape juice made, uh, from their land as well. So it's a wow. very all-natural thing here. Delicious. I just got... Del yum! Um, I'm going, I'm feeling an L. Okay. Do they, do I have like a total amount of points? Like, am I actually spinning <laughs> yeah, for look points? On the yeah, or am I just... Current score. Mmm, a tool that helps from satellite. What word would have an L for the second? What, yeah, what word is the little, little? Is this going to be, this one wasn't sponsored, right? This is this one is not sponsored. So it's not going to be like proprietary technology. Um, <laughs> does anybody have any guesses on Twitch? Well, Chad is saying that I said GPS, and this is what GPS technically stands for. Oh, oh, yeah. But I said GPS at the beginning, and I, I was my brain doesn't know what GPS stands for. So it's global positioning system yes that any child would know that obviously hit solve now sarah let's do it we've got it i'll let you type it in five strikes. nothing's happening wait really do we have to spin again oh do i have to like type it in oh that's really odd so I did mean, it maybe... even like trigger you hitting solve now kids kids could know this it's possible I mean, I guess you just have to keep clicking. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> Look at you that. Da, 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 da! <laughs> the beautiful field. All right. We did it. Did you know new technology in agriculture makes it possible for farmers and ranchers to produce more food and fiber on less land? Fiber. To produce fiber. Fiber. Hang on. Tap on the picture to print out a certificate with a stamp. Oh my God, Sarah. Click on that. Don't have a passport to sustainability? Download it now. All right. I don't know what to click on first. Why is I need to download our passport. Why is it the Red Dead Redemption? Whoopsers. whoopsers. Oh, whoopsers. You can't whoopser a farmer. Is this going to work? Oh, my God. <laughs> also, whoopsers. Not allowable. It's, it's giving, ooh, we made a fuggy wuggy. Come on. Whoopsers, my butt. Whoopsers. All right, where are we going? Oh, this. See, this looks like it's going to be like whitewater rafting or something. One? Ooh. It's. I don't know. Where are you getting these ideas that like they're going to be like incredible games? I want to play one that got an award, not the beef one, because it has the math in it. Okay, so award winning, not beef. Yeah. Oh, this one's brought to you by U.S. Poultry. I love a that poultry. That has math in it, though. Well, we learned that. We don't like it. We truly hate it. But how does this one grocery grab? Okay, get that one. Sarah, how are you bad at math, but you're also, if I may toot your horn, like a 4.0 student? There's different types of intelligence. Yeah, but I you was were good, good enough at, at math to get a good grade, but I'm overall very bad at math. But you probably did like calculus and smart person stuff. Yeah, you can you can pass a class. I can, the knowledge can be in my body yeah. for the day of the test, and then it just flees. Okay, okay. Uh, grocery grab, award-winning grocery grab. Become a master meal builder and grocery store expert. In this fun game, you'll beef up your nutrition knowledge. All right, I'm going to jump in and play. Ooh. Oh, ooh. Wait, Chef hat. is that supposed to be a construction hat? No, we have to do the cowboy hat. Yeah, I guess. It's not little enough for you, though. Ooh. 
It's like Mario Party. Your no. First destination. There you go. There you go. To have a balanced diet, you must eat food from all the different food groups. Today, we'll build a menu with beef. Drag a food item from the kitchen to build your shopping list. You'll know you've created a balanced meal when your list has all green check marks. Okay. Uh, okay, you gotta do it fast though. You got you got a know. timer. I'm scared. Is it gonna be like a balanced meal? Is five servings of beef per day? Yeah. Okay, so more beef. I think they're I think they're trying to convince us that beef is actually a part of your balanced diet. Okay, grains, Sarah. Grains. Is this bread or is that ham? That's beef. Okay, I'm gonna put a protein, dairy. You got that? Grains. These I assume that's spaghetti. Freezer noodles. I mean rice. Rice is a grain. Uh, fruits, 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 fruits. They're on the counter, Ben. They're on the counter. But these might be strawberries. <laughs> this is meatballs. Uh, check. Key. Beef is a great source of protein. B6. Don't forget about only beef, nothing else. Niacin. Uh, I'll take a recipe. What? Sweet <laughs> and sloppy. You can make this for dough. your wife when she asks for dinner again. Done and done. Let's make sure to download Sweet and Sloppy Joe. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> what have we what done? What did you do? What Are, we... Did you just download a virus, Ben? Um. No, I didn't download a virus, Sarah. Don't be silly. Okay. Don't open your, oh wait, this is, don't, yeah, don't be open in your file navigators. Okay, it's there fine. we go, you did it. Look, we're a transparent company here at MinMax. Have at it, everybody. <laughs> uh, okay, as long as we're kind of still online. Okay, and I think we are. I think we're good. Oh, thank you, Joar Hello, for the big sub. All right, here we go, going next. Move your game piece to the second destination. I will. Welcome. What cut of meat will you need for the picture of food next to me? Drag oh. the meat into your shopping cart. Get ready, because once you begin, the timer starts. Wait, the timer? We're striking one thing and we have a minute to do it? Yeah, but you have to, you have to, what? They're trying to teach us the different types, the cuts of meat. Right. Uh, the different cuts of beef. This is T-bone if I've ever seen it, right? Yeah. Here we go, T-bone. Oh, God. Look for a steak that has no bones. Wouldn't it be funny if I dragged him into the cart, Sarah? Wouldn't that be a hoot? <laughs> he has bones, though. Doesn't look like he has a freaking backbone, this coward. What are these photos? Um, I mean, like, ground beef has no bones, stew meat has no bones. I'm pretty sure sirloin doesn't have any bones. Yeah, it's this. I... Yes! Like, what? the pictures suck. Yeah, they really are like, bad. Like, what am I... That's just, like, a thinly cut... Um, that feels like it's... Stew meat? Oh. I think it's sirloin again. There's no way, Sarah. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be damned. I love that this is just like, how did this win an award? Like this is just forcing kids to learn the different cuts of beef. I think they just submitted it at a time when someone was really hungry. And so I was like, well, this or is like, the greatest like, camera the ever higher ups, they were like, these kids don't Let's know Let's try to build a meal using beef again. Ribeyes. Can you beat your time right. from round one? Yeah, meanwhile, okay. Forspoken from Square Enix doesn't win a single freaking award. And meanwhile, this game over here is winning all of it. Horrendous, horrendous. All right, create a meal with beef. We've already done this. Oh, this is so propaganda. So stew meat. Yeah. Yep. And then uh, your what, veggies in. This is this will be a veggie salad. Uh, let's eat a nanner with a steak. It's my favorite yes. combo. Uh, is this just a towel? I don't know what that is. Is it like naan? <gasps> Who knows? Uh, Who it's knows? Working. Uh, I love my milk, beef, banana salad. Delicious. Well, we're gonna find out how to look this. Stop it, Ben! Spy tie. I've never even heard of spy tie, but I'll be damned. Okay, here we go. Fourth destination. This is fun. It's a glow. Beef product. is given in different grades. A quality oh grade God. tells you about the tenderness, juiciness, and flavor of the meat you're eating. Match the quality grades to the steaks. What you tell? Want me I to tell the difference, the difference between, between choice prime and select is? We need Which more the info. Best one? Okay. Wait, what does this say? Okay. Hold on, I'm taking over. All right, do it. The most white specks. Guess again, what? hot shot. Oh, this is choice. Moderate. Got it. Oh my gosh. There we go. 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna take out a jalapeno from the spicy jar. I'm grabbing our hat. Thank you. Head to head challenge. Grab a friend, family member, or challenge yourself. That's me. That's me. I'm all three of those things. Okay. Ready? Am I steering this yeah. again? Here's your chance to be a meal building master. Right. Okay. In this round, I'll go first. you'll go okay. head to head with another player. You'll each have one chance to build a well balanced meal. You'll be judged on speed and accuracy, so work quickly. Okay. All right, don't blow it, Sarah. I'm gonna go first. What? Lame. Excuse me? <laughs> You're botching it. You're botching it left and right. What the fuck? You call that dairy? That was a slab of meat like oh, a Flintstone. Oh, you have to you have to put it. Okay. Now it's play I didn't know that turn. you had to put it in if the very specific second player, spot. Try to beat your time in this round. Don't blow it. The timer it. will start when the first uh. item is dropped on the list. All right. And here we go. What? <laughs> Shoot, 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 You think shoot. you're already going faster than me. Time. Yeah, you won. I didn't know you had to put it on the specific spot. Ladies and gentlemen, is this your king? Come on. How do you not know that, Sarah? That's farming 101. I don't know my beefs. <laughs> what, do they expect just like two people cuddling around a computer playing this on the same do you screen? you plan to eat more? Less or the same amount of beef. They're literally like, after playing this game, will you eat more beef? Take our beef survey. Would you please eat more beef? Uh, say more. No, say less. Say less. Tell me to go. Take this big rocks. beef. Yeah, kick rocks. Actually, seeing the raw beef made me um, never want to eat beef again. Mm -mm. Claim the reward. Ha! You get your own bull for your foot. How what? can they eat grass? Term to know. Bull. Whoa. That's pretty sweet. Yo. Look at them. They have four stomachs. Cut out this stamp and attach it to your passport. Don't think I won't. Don't think I won't. Sweet. We did it. Okay. That was exactly what I wanted it to be. That was even a great if it game. was the worst that it could possibly be. Okay, Sarah, it's on you. You're steering. What, I picked the last one. Did you? Yeah. Okay, all right, I guess the I'll take one. it then. Um, ooh, memory match. I do like those games. Uh, oh. Fly down to Pollinatorville. This is pretty good. It's geography. Ew. Amazing grains? Mm, That's math in it. Yeah, no thanks. Um, I'm gonna try this buzz one. I like bees. Welcome. There are more than just people who work in Pollinatorville. Pollinator Discover Ville. the insects that are busy there too. All right. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play 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 now. Hang on, hang on, Sarah. Copyright free beats. <laughs> All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is a little song about farming. I think these beats are too slow. Oh, just wait. Once it kicks in. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play play now. Play 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 now. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play now. Play play now. Play 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 now. Pick a pollinator. Okay, here we go. Uh, monarch all day, please. Pick a crop. Pumpkin all day. Let's pollinate. Gross. Oh, go pollinate! Woo! Wait. And then you drag it. Yeah, bring it to the other yeah. plant. Sweet. <laughs> Everyone's saying ew. <laughs> uh, pick a pollinator or place on the farm. Well, let's send the bees into the match the pollinator parts oh this is cool i like this abdomen is clearly the abdomen abdomen is the abdomen thorax so thorax is first abdomen second in the row um antenna i got that wings here we go way to go you did it hell yeah honeybees do more pollination than any other insect 
figured as much. So they want an award for that? <laughs> Put on your hat! Yay! And now, the bee has a hat on! It's just smothering the bee. All right, here we go. Match the pollinator parts. I can do this. I can do this. Pollinator. It's literally the same as the bee, but like without the stinger. And Sarah, we all know yeah. which which goes where. Its abdomen would be first, but on the bee wasn't like the thorax first. Yeah, but why is you the abdomen the both butt? ways. Come on. Howard. I feel like they could name that something easier. There are about 18,000 different kinds of butterflies. How much do you think um, it costs to make this site? Is this like $10 million? I want to know what the contract was, you know? Uh, this it's, it's is a farm be field. Like, Farmers work hard to care like for these plants. But someone else works here too. Like, Who works here? Hang on. Hang on, say I can't hear you over the bees. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And yeah, it definitely feels like um, they paid a ton of money to some people to make bad Flash games. Yeah, but hey, good on them. It's a, this could be a great game designer's first credit, you know? All right, we want to keep Isn't the- everyone technically work go. here? The, the birds Bees aren't allowed? Absolutely not. Stick to them. Absolutely not. Okay, let's see, ooh. These are special boxes. Farmers use these to provide a home for important pollinators. It's cupcakes and starfish, Cupca here? cupcakes and starfish. If there was a new show plus option, Sarah, that was like getting into uh, being a beekeeper, would you wear the full beekeeper suit? If it required me to stand next to bees. Y yeah, then yes. Cause like sometimes bees don't sting you though. Well, if you're wearing the suit, you're not gonna get stung. I mean, I'd wear the suit. Amongst the bees. If I thought I was gonna get stung, yeah. Okay, so you're not scared of it. That's cool. No. Uh, okay, when was the last time you got stung by a bee? When I was like four. Four, really? Yeah. You're lucky. It wasn't the bee's fault though. I accidentally like put my hand on top of it. Oh, uh, were you trying I to pet it? it and I accidentally like touched it. Yeah. A bee box I got stung last fall, and it was just a good reminder that it's a real thing that can happen. I was at like an autumnal <laughs> A real thing that could place. really happen. Yeah, because you forget about it as an adult. It's like, oh no, that, that hurts. That's a thing. This is milkweed. It grows up to six feet tall and has large Penguins. 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 In the summer. Penguins. Here. Well, surely the trout Way would at least try to eat it. Adult butterflies only feed on liquids like nectar Ish. from flowers. That is weird. They turn into Great butterflies job. and then they only eat liquids. That's like the reverse of babies. Okay, here we go. I guess that's true. Thank you. We did it. We well, gotta cut that out. Sweet. All right, one more to close it off here, Sarah. Yeah. I'll, I'll let you what be do the we got? be the queen. We've done so many things. This today. is a tough one, though. Yeah. To close it out. Where in the world? Thrive. Thrive is a good name. I feel like you could get a triple-A game that's called Thrive, and it might do okay. But engineering, I don't know what that means, really. Yeah, I don't really want to test different soil types. No. The Great Seed Search? That does seem fun. There is math. Could be interesting. I was thinking we could just ignore it. Oh, there's That's Life. That is life. <laughs> Oh, the chickens there's might be lot. cute. An egg sighting oh, poultry adventure? It's math. We're just going to be like counting eggs. Uh, I don't want to do yeah, that hard work Yeah, you count your flocks. Them. Yeah, come on. Join the flock. Hmm. I don't mind joining flocks. Okay. Ish. Look at Keys that logo. To stewardship. <laughs> That's an aggressive logo. What's a tangram? Where Solving a series of tangrams. Let's find out. English language arts, that's our specialty. Is it? What do you mean by our specialty? We're really good at English language arts. Time for Time tangrams. Time for tangrams. <laughs> All right. This sounds horrible. What does the word steward mean? Mm -hmm. Way to go. Is that it? You know your egg facts. You do certainly know Is this know it? Is this facts. just asking me the definition of words? Love it. Oh no. 
Choose what? a tangram puzzle to solve. Oh, it's one of these? Uh, okay, let's pick the easiest one. Oh, okay. I don't mind these. Can I turn them? No. I think I walked down the aisle to this song. All right, this is fun. It sounds like chickens. Nice. Why does this have to be a farming? That sound. I like that you you have to do the puzzle and then you get a fact. Right. That's called <laughs> a reward. Shot? Crop rotation is when farmers grow different crops in their fields each year. When farmers rotate planting a few different crops, the soil becomes healthier and there are fewer pests. This means less pesticide and fertilizer. Sweet. Okay, you can do the next one. I can? All right. Mm -hmm. Assuming control. I did the easiest one, so best of luck. I'm going to do this guy who's doing a hot TikTok dance. Oh, I didn't even need to solve anything. Yeah, where, what happened to my word puzzles? All right. This is obviously his foot. This is obviously up here. Hey. Come on now. Wait, this one feels easier than mine. No, I'm just actually really, really smart. When a farmer lets natural grasses grow, plants a crop to cover. Okay. All right. That's wonderful. Take it. Complete four out of six and earn your mini prize. Mini, mini prize. They're trying to lower our expectations here. Sarah, you're taking the boring, easy ones. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? Yeah, I guess that's fair. Where does it say that I can't take the easy way? But there's out? a cool looking duck. <clears throat> mm. Does it snap? Why doesn't? <laughs> oh, that's apparently a no go. Sarah's forfeiting already. Okay. Nice. Pasture rotation, also called rotational grazing, is when ranchers rotate livestock animals to different pastures for grazing. This allows natural grasses and other plants to grow stronger and healthier while livestock graze in other pastures. Not bad. Clap, clap, clap. Not bad, hot shot. Okay, four out of six. Here we go. Last one. I'm doing the full duck. They said it was impossible. Oh, yeah. No one believed they said in it me. Was impossible. I see you Twitch chat screaming, it can't be done, it can't be done. Well, I'm here to tell He's you a that. mad lad. Yeah, Tangram is my middle name. Um, no, that's not right. Okay, I'm catching on. Gotta say, this is the most fun I've had so far. <laughs> I like these little puzzles. Hmm, <laughs> you bet. Give what me the does key. The word steward mean? We literally just answered this. Leave us alone. Go. You know your egg facts. Do we just have to do it again? Oh, you want a field designed using contour farming. Contour farming is practice. We got a whole field? Whoa. Uh, I need to install a new your GeForce, GeForce driver for this. Right away. <laughs> yeah. To have on the picture to print it. This seems sweet. Oh, man. Look at all these. Wow. Done and done. Help. Oh, I see, I see. Hey, ladies Was and that gentlemen. It? Was that the end? I think that's it for myamericanfarm.org. Uh, gotta say, less fully featured than I was promised on that billboard, but a lot higher quality than I was expecting uh, for the games. Sarah, what'd you learn today? I learned nothing. Nothing at all. Oh, 2015 prizes? App tips? Okay, this is this is sweet. All right, maybe, look, you don't have to do anything, but you can install these apps at home. You will have tracking information put in there from uh, the Beef Council, so you need to prepare for that. Uh, thank you all for supporting MidMax uh, and voting for things like myamericanfarm.org. Sarah, um, next week for New Show Plus, people at the Backstage Pass here can vote. It, do they vote for us to keep playing more of these games, or do they vote for us to check out a different .org site? Ooh, like another edutainment. Yeah. Yeah, but I think people would have to, like, suggest edutainment. Like, okay. I don't know how we would find it. Yeah, crowdsource some some options. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, hey, thanks so much, everybody, for supporting this type of thing. We appreciate it. Patreon.com slash minmax with two N's. Uh, see you later, partners. Bye.
Farmers aren't cowboys, I guess. That's kind of a confusing thing to say. Every week, we let Patreon supporters choose which new show we create with New Show Plus. Should we create another episode of the show you just watched? Check out the biggest new game release? Get into Sea of Thieves? Create an exercise show? It is your call. So thanks to everybody who subscribes on YouTube or supports us over on Patreon. MinMax exists because of you. As always, if you enjoy MinMax content, any help telling a friend is appreciated.